Hello everyone. Today we shall look into east blank and east empty functions. East blank function it checks whether a value is blank or not and it returns true or false. East empty function it checks whether a table has rows or not. If there are no rows present, it will return true. If there are rows present, it will return false. Let us see how it works. Here we have a purchase table where I have a few brands and uh, units purchased. Okay, let us uh, see whether the blanks exist or not. I'll create a new column. I'll write is blank units equal to is blank units from the purchase table and hit enter. Here you could see that wherever my rows are blank from the units column we are able to uh, you know, see the true condition. I will create a new column. Let us see if it works similar to the brand column or not. I will write is blank brand equal to is blank purchase brand column. Here we could see that for the, bra for the brand column even though there are blanks existing, we are able to see the false condition instead of true condition. Hence, you could understand that is blank function is applicable only for the numerical values which are existing and we could make utilization of it and then uh, we could uh, correct if uh, necessary. Suppose that here in the place of blanks in the units column, I want to replace the values with zero. What I could do is, I will write new units equal to if I will write is blank if my purchase units column is blank what I want is, I will enter 0 if it is not blank, I want purchase units column I will close the parenthesis, hit enter here you could see that my new units column it consists of zero in the place of blanks. This is how is blank function is helpful. Let us see how is empty function works. We can create an empty table. I'll click on this home tab and click on the enter data. Okay, I'll uh, create an empty table. I'll name the table as empty table. I'll just load without typing anything. Okay, here my empty table is now loaded. I'll uh, show this empty table in the data view. Here in the data view, if I click on the empty table, you could see that there are no rows and no columns. I'll move to the report view. I'll click on example. Here we, we have this empty text card. I'll create a new measure where I'll make use of this is empty function. I'll write is empty measure equal to is empty I'll write the table name which is empty table I'll close the parenthesis hit enter we have this text card I'll click on this text card and uh, select the measure you could see that my empty table is now uh, you know it is representing true condition where it is em empty Suppose that I use sales table where my data is present and if you want to check whether it is empty or not you could uh, see the output as false because my data exists in sales table. This is how is empty function is helpful to validate whether the table has rows or not using measure. This is all for now. Thank you for watching and we shall meet in the next video.